Okay, couch potatoes, today we are going to talk about couch cushioning. If your cushions are sagging a little or they're not exactly right, don't worry about it. There are plenty of things you can do to turn those cushions from flat to fluffy in no time. What causes couch cushions to sag? Generally, there are two reasons why couch cushions might sag. Number one, it's generally because of overuse. And that doesn't mean you're using it too much, but it may mean that you're using too much in one specific area. This is why rotating your cushions, flipping them if possible, and just generally using different parts of the cushion evenly is so important. Because if you sit in one place over, over, and over, and over again, you're likely to have a very saggy cushion. The second thing is there could be, and this is extremely rare, but there could be something going on with the spring support or webbing support system underneath your couch cushions. How do you rehab couch cushions? There are a few issues that people have with their couch cushions. One is that it can get a little bit like the fabric seems stretched or it's out of place. If your couch has a zipper, take it off, open the zipper up and just get your hand in there. You can actually maneuver the cushions around. A lot of times you'll notice that you're sitting on a couch for a long time. You'll get up and you'll see that the seam is not quite aligned with the corner. If you see that, that's not a huge deal. Just open that zipper, get in the back and start moving things around. Let's say your cushions don't have a zipper, also not a problem. You can use your hands to maneuver the fabric around a little bit over the cushion. The point is, it's something you can fix. It's not something you just have to accept or live with. The other way to rehab couch cushions is to literally replace the stuffing inside them. You can rehab your couch cushions by removing that foam insert and replacing it with a new one. That's something you can do by either contacting the company that you bought the couch from, or if you want to DIY it, you can go take it to a local foam supplier, use uh, google.com to find the one nearest you, bring your couch cushion and they can cut you a new piece of foam for usually around 25 to $50 for a standard couch cushion, and it will be as if you got brand new cushions. How can I make my couch cushions firmer? One sort of cheat or hack is to put a piece of wood, a piece of plywood underneath your couch cushions. People have done this in the past with like mattresses to make them a little bit firmer. It's actually surprising what kind of wonders this can do. It's, it, it, it seems like it's almost like a princess and the pea type of a moment where it's like, how would that make a difference? But it really does. Try it out, take a piece of wood, maybe you have something around your house that you can do as a little test. Put something hard underneath your couch, even some books, to see if it makes a difference. If you're feeling like you're onto something, maybe go to Home Depot, have them cut you a nice piece of wood that goes right underneath your couch cushions to fit it exactly to the right size.